welcome back to Only Analog. This is episode 11, and today we are down in Rye and we are using these two TLR cameras. So I've just acquired this camera. This is a Rolleiflex 3.5T, and it was kindly given to me by a really nice gentleman called Greg. So thank you very much, Greg, if you're watching. And Tom also shot on his Rolleicord, uh, which is the, the K3, which is a 1938, I believe. So we're not going to go into too much detail on the specifications of the cameras uh, in this video but we are going to be making a video in the near future and we're going to dive right into all the specs. Um, but these three are actually Tom's, so Tom's got the Rode Flex and two Rode cords and this is my Rode Flex and what we were planning on doing was sort of pitting two of them together, um, either Rode or Rode Flex or Rode Flex versus Rode Flex of a different model and sort of comparing um, comparing the images from the two and seeing uh, how that goes. So, so if there's any combination of these that you want to see uh, go head to head, uh, for instance Rode Flex versus Rode Cord or Rode Flex, uh, drop a comment below and we'll consider the options. So we're down in Rye today and the reason we're taking these cameras is I've only just got this back um, from the repair shop. Um, shout out to the guys at CamServe in Hailsham that did that for me. Um, I've just got it back and we sort of went out for the day to just shoot a cut a roll for it really didn't we? Um, obviously Tom bought his rolly cord. Um, so this is just a short video on what you can sort of expect to see from these sorts of cameras. We both put a roll of um, MPC through which was expired and then we both jumped onto the black and white and took a few shots as well before it got too dark. Um, but yeah as I said in the near future we are going to be going out again and um, pitting these, these beautiful TLRs against each other. And um, in future videos, this is basically going to be my main camera. Uh, Josh is in love with his Pentax 6-7 now, so... Which I've, is yet to be debuted. Yeah, which is yet to be debuted, so I do apologise Josh for letting a spoiler, <laughs> spoiler alert. But yeah, this is going to be my main camera. I love shooting on these, these old TLRs because they're just nostalgia reasons and I just always love these they're cameras. Just, yeah, it's so fun to use. Um, so yeah, as I said, come along with us. Um, if you are new here, please do consider hitting that subscribe button and the little bell icon. It really does mean the world to me and Tom every time we do get a new subscriber, so please do consider it. Yeah, enjoy today's video and we will see you soon. What I like about this shot is you've got a beautiful depth of fill. If you look straight down the red, there's a beautiful line just flowing straight from red. You've got this beautiful old uh, mid-century, 14th century building, sort of just in the middle here. It's absolutely exquisite through the viewfinder. <laughs> exquisite. <laughs>
<laughs> you do not want to be doing that. I do not want to be doing that. <laughs> 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 I'm so glad I filmed that. <laughs> Thank you for joining us today. Uh, if you have made it this far, please do consider hitting that subscribe button. Uh, as I said in the intro, we are going to be doing a lot more with these cameras, um, head to heads and things like that. So if you are interested in that, hit that subscribe button. Yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for joining us again, and we will definitely see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs> I was going in at the end. <laughs>